guys, hope everyone's doing well. It's two o'clock on what day is it, Rox? The Wednesday. <laughs> Feeling a bit better today. I actually slept through the night. Oh, sorry, the handle from the camera just hit Roxy in the ear and she doesn't like it. Uh, yeah, definitely feeling a bit brighter. I slept through the night last night, first time in about three weeks, which was good. No waking up at four o'clock, having a coffin fit. Um, had a coffin fit once I woke up and started moving around, because obviously it dislodges everything. But don't feel as lousy as I felt, even yesterday, in fact. So the coffin today is a lot drier, if that makes any sense. So it's I don't feel like it's a chest infection anymore, because... I know it did get to that point, and uh, maybe in 2014 I'll start taking better care of myself. But for now, I have to do what I have to do to get through each day. And it's just been crazy busy, and I think my problem is I got really run down and lack of sleep. And then Pete bought the cold home, and um, it hit me like a ton of bricks. And this happened to me once before, lashed, lashed? Last summer, I had this for about, oh, I'm even afraid to admit it, but my mother knows. It was about nine weeks all said and done, and it was horrible. And it was a lot more intense than this. So I was kind of watching it this time, and if it got to that point, um, I would have done something about it a lot sooner. But I've just been taking some over-the-counter cold and flu medicine, and... Um, chomping on some lovely cough drops, which aren't so bad, the re regular, we well, can't even say that normal, can you? You have to say. Um, so I've been getting some work done, I was out and about most of the day when I got my thumb fixed, and from there I went over, dropped off my prescription, and I was hoping I could wait for it, but they were really busy, and she said, <coughs> <coughs> can you come back at two, it's now two, and I know I got Katie soon, so I, I don't want to go back out. It's um, it's not as cold today, but it's rainy and a bit windy. And I just think going in and out is not going to do me any favors because I feel like this is actually really, really on its way out. I feel like there's definitely a light at the end of the... Peach should be home around six, you think, Roxy? Roxy's under the camera. Oh, you probably saw her ear just then. She's right here. Hello, Roxy. Just give me such a look. Um, I, th I tried to ask him if we could put the tree up tonight just to get the tree up and then Ash and I are going to decorate it in the morning because Pete's now going to go to the turkey trot and take pictures of everybody for the yearbook. Even though some of, uh, some of our staff, I can say our staff now, are um, working it and they're going to take pictures as well but Pete wants to go and take pictures of them working it, if that makes sense. I have to make the desserts tonight. I have to make the bread tonight. And uh, that's it, really, for today. I don't think everything else... Oh, wouldn't you know it? Oh, I had to go to the school today, too, because people were dropping off more senior quotes and baby pictures, so I went to pick them up. But now I'm getting calls from kids. Where's my pictures? On that note, I'm going to love and leave you guys now. I sound raw, but I'm not real. I, I swear to you, I'm not feeling as bad as I have. I'm actually quite clear. I can breathe. I have 50% taste buds back. And uh, I'm watching some TV. Got the fireplace going. And I've been answering some emails for Pete and dealing with some people. Look how cute that fireplace is. Look at Louis. So I'm enjoying that right now. Got Roxy right here. Leave you for now. And I'll talk to you in a bit. I think this is the most I've spoken in two and a half weeks. Bye, guys. So Ashley's happy. Her tree's up. So we're decorating the morning, Ash? Yeah. It's taller than the other tree. It is a bit taller. No, actually, this, must be, this, this is seven and a half. The other one was seven. The okay. treetopper is not going to be able to figure out. Oh, we'll always, we always figure it out. So Ashley, as long as Ashley's happy. Portland turns it off, though, which is weird. I guess they don't have to 
Oh wait, it has well, the stuffing thing too. Put a, leave it on one setting for now. And I know, then I'm just showing the different Yeah, thing. use the foot thing to turn it on and off over there. Foot's not all that solid. What do you mean? It's got the, the little switch that actually is trying to change it from white to color. Oh. It has one setting where it, it alternates back and forth too. Yeah, that's what you're there's saying. There's four settings on it and there's one that turns them off from that. We we'll use the little other switch to turn it off. I think I think it's as full as our other one, don't you? Like the branches and stuff. Yeah. I don't think it's. I don't think there's as many lights inside of it as the other one. I don't think we're ever gonna find that, to be honest, because yeah. that was like, that was what? How many years ago was that? Seven, six? And we it really did us well. I mean, your dad used to love it. I like it. Mm. Right, let's get Ashley's picture. So tomorrow we can put the ornaments on it. Guys, just going to end the vlog here. It's 10 o'clock because uh, I still have to make the desserts and the beer bread for tomorrow. I actually called up the stairs and said uh, we're putting up the tree and by the time I went downstairs about 15 minutes later it was already done and the lights were on. And we've already had the, how the living room rearranged enough that didn't even have to rearrange furniture this year so that was nice. Um, Louis's bed is the only thing we had to move and Pete's made him a nice little area in the other corner which was wasted space anyway. So Louis still got his bed and he can be comfortable and uh, I'm going to download this now, have a cup of tea which is right here and then I'm going to make these things for tomorrow. So then tomorrow won't be such a stressful day. So it's nice, we can just get up, do the tree, and do anything else I didn't get to do tonight. Ash wants to make some cookies as well. Today, again, still feeling brighter, still, f I see. Today, I named my week, actually. I don't know if any of you are old enough to remember that song um, by Chumba Wumba, I Got Knocked Down. <laughs> That's the story of my life this week. I got knocked down, but I get up again. You're never going to keep me down. So that, I feel, is very appropriate for this week. Oh, and let me ask you a question. I don't know if I've asked this question before. What did I? Have I asked you guys white lights or colored lights on your tree? I did, didn't I? Must have done by now. Okay, here's a silly question for you. It doesn't matter if you're 2, 52, or 102. Do you have an advent calendar? So do you count down Christmas with an advent calendar, whether it be a chocolate one, a picture one, or one that has little ornaments and things like that in it? I saw a really nice one in Starbucks, and I should have just got it when I saw it, because it had a little tiny different gifts in it. And I think one area had a, like a $5 Starbucks card, but by the time I went back, they were all gone. But I thought that would have been something cool as a gift for a couple of people I know. And I feel really bad that they're gone. But if I do see one when I'm out on Friday, I will pick them up. Even though by the time I get them to people, they will be late. But it's kind of still fun. Again, I hope everyone had a wonderful Wednesday. And if you celebrate Thanksgiving, if you're in the States, I hope you have a wonderful time tomorrow with your family. That's two wonderfuls in two sentences. You can tell I'm feeling better. But I hope you have a great Thanksgiving, to whatever you're doing, whether you're home with your family or going away. Safe travels, stay safe. I'm going to love and leave you for now, and I will see you later. Bye, guys.